This is not a scientific discovery, but it is an internet discovery. Uh, one man has taken a picture of the famed South American Goliath bird eater, and now look at it. Oh! Oh! It's a hand! <laughs> Dissolve oh. into terrifying. The, it's a very, very big spider. Uh, it can reach up to one foot and it can weigh six ounces. That doesn't sound like a lot, but look at it, it is a lot. It is a, the colossal arachnid is actually the world's largest spider according to the Guinness World Records. Um, oh. Yeah, it's, uh, it's about the size of a child's forearm and the body of the size of a large fist is according to this. And about the size of a puppy. Like if a puppy yeah. were horrifying and just Wonderful. crawling around leaf litter in the rainforest. Equating the most horrific thing in the entire world with the most adorable thing the in the entire thing. world. Let's um, pollute it's perfect. one of them. I know that no one can see this, but I will bring you in on a little TV magic on the monitor here. Um, in the studio of the Young Turks, the uh, photo was, was being shown. And uh, they're, they're pretty big monitors. It was like six feet Six feet by six feet. It was huge. It was terrifying. Well, that is enlarged uh, in scale. There's a little bit of scale. A, um, a so little bit thankfully, people will watch this on a small Thank YouTube God, window. Thank God, but it's still terrifying. Um, <laughs> there's some more terrifying facts about this. Yes. In that it sounds when it's, it has a telltale sound when it's going walking through the forest like a horse. Uh, they noted like a little horse, but still a horse. That's a lot for a spider. <laughs> well, and the, the legs have hairy hook and loops mm -hmm. that connect with each other that when they walk, it sounds like Velcro oh. ripping apart. So imagine like a little hairy horse sounding Velcro. like Velcro walking through the forest. And you're like, oh, you know what? It's my day to die. And that's the sound they make when they are like sloughing the barbs off of their legs up into the air to get into your eyes. Right. The, the scientist, or if he is a scientist who discovered this, said, oh, isn't that cute? It's adorable. But no, those are little barbs. Yeah. They're just going to stick in your face. Yeah. That's what, it, that's what well, he that's did. Worst puppy uh, we didn't say his name. Pete. Pietor, Pietor Nascrecchi, mm -hmm. which I apologize, uh, he's a photographer from Harvard University's yeah. Museum of Comparative Zoology. Yeah. So he is a researcher, I okay. think, or somewhat related to researcher. Perfect. I like his little his, uh, uh, shadow and highlights filter that he did on mm -hmm. the photo, too. It really brings out the terrifying. Yeah. Uh, like, well, he said it, he, he described the, the rubbing that you said as cute, but then he realized those barbed little pieces of hair are meant to blind you. Yeah. This dog horse spider wants to blind you. So that makes it all the more uh, fitting for Halloween as we draw closer. I think it's horrifying that it's named the bird eater, even yeah. though it does that very rarely. Yeah. It means that like scientists were observing it and like trying to think of names for it, and then they saw it eat a bird, and they're like, well, we have to call it that. That's <laughs> horrifying. It can. Um, well, it generally sticks to the, the floor, like in mm. the leaf litter. Uh, but it, if, if it finds a bird nest, it can kill the parent bird and eat all the eggs as well, easily. Mm. Easily. Tasty. Which brings me to the question, what is the most horrifying animal you can think of besides this horrifying animal? Uh, I could be like all alt and be like, humans. <laughs> but no, I, I think the worst thing is the foot-long uh, isopod that uh, you might remember from the movie The Bay. Uh, we've covered it on Dweebcast a couple of times. Um, it's basically a crustacean type creature, like a shelled animal that is in underwater that is this big. Mm -hmm. And it has like legs that stick out and a horrible fangy face. And I mean, it, it literally foot, a foot long. Terrifying. The worst. As a man, it would have to be the dreaded candiru. Is that the one that, like, when you're peeing? The Amazonian fish that swims up your urethra and then hooks its little barbs in? Yeah, that sounds like the worst thing that's ever been designed and exists. It's funny that we're all picking small animals. Uh, I think the scariest animal is the mosquito because it's the, most, the animal most responsible for human deaths in the world. Okay. So, okay. you should be scared because it can come in very harmless looking packages and kill you with malaria. All right, yeah. malaria is scary. All right, you win. Yeah, uh, that's what I was looking for <laughs> this whole time. Um, so uh, the, the researchers had only seen this uh, puppy-sized spider, he said, about three times. Um, he said it, if it bit you, it probably wouldn't be that bad on par of if a chicken bit you. I've never seen a chicken bite me, but now I'm uh, horrified of that. <laughs> you just can't go outside. No, like I don't. Terrifying. That's why I'm an indoor person. And now it's in a museum. 
as just a little like tag at the end of the story, like, oh, it's been deposited into a museum, like alive, dead, what happened to it? How did he kill it? Are there more here? Are they reproducing? Is he bringing it to America? Do we need to call the president? I think we're okay on that. I think we're okay. Right, oh, but it is in Washington. So. Besides, I have a specimen right here no! if you want to see. I'll leave him down there. Okay, thank you, Tim. What do you think of the South American Goliath bird eater? Again, not a scientific discovery, an internet discovery that has been brought to our attention and the chill of our hearts at night. Uh, what, let us know all that you think about this and what is the scariest animal you can think of below in the comments and please be sure to subscribe.